I'm teaching mostly marketing stuff. Today, I'm going to talk about how to create unique and valuable content about anything under the planet using AI. All right, welcome back to day 11 of how to use artificial intelligence to grow and scale your business. And we haven't talked a bit about scaling yet. And there is so much more to share. I'm already using mostly marketing related things. I'm teaching mostly marketing stuff. Today, I'm going to talk about how to create unique and valuable content about anything under the planet using AI. So imagine that you want to create uh, a topic, like topic, something that you want to create, uh, like unique, how to create unique and valuable content about anything. Like tell me something that you want to create on. So I'm, I'm going to go something weird. So, so I'm going to go on YouTube. Um, I'm going to go on YouTube and, and let's say, um, so let's say I need to find out something about uh, marine uh, biology. A very, very interesting topic, right? Marine biology. Um, um, so marine biology, let's try to find, uh, you should know about later marine biology. Marine biology, let's say shark. So let's say we we want to write a we want to create a really good content about sharks. Uh, watch marine biologist shark uh, shark questions from Twitter. Marine biologist break down shark attack scenes. Uh, okay, about shark attacks. So 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 level one is like for example, if you want to learn about shark attack. So first of all, the the first thing is you could uh, you could say um, um, level article on shark attack. Uh, so uh, create a marine biologist level advanced article on shark attacks uh, and um, shark attacks. So it's very simple, right? So I'll go with that on level one and it will generate content. And it's going to generate it for you. So as you could see, it's generating content without much details. So you could actually copy this. And I'm going to send you this. I mean, this prompt is very easy for you anyway. Create a marine wireless level advanced article on shark attacks. Right? So and I'm going to show you something really interesting on this video. Let's say it continues the, the video. I'm going to close all the other tabs. So this way, you could just go to YouTube right away. So this is the article. OK, got it. So now, uh, this is content. And this is your unique content, right? And it's a content that uh, OpenAI created for you. Who owns this? I don't know. Nobody knows. OpenAI might be owning it. You might be owning it. Ideally, I think you should own it if you created it. But it uh, doesn't matter. So now. You want to get like more, more deep into this, right? So create a marine biologist level advanced article on shark attacks. That's the first prompt that you gave. And, and the second prompt, I'm going to make it a little bit more fancy. So this way it's more clear. You're like, okay, I want to like, like give me the best shark attack videos. For example, marine biologist about shark attacks. And let's break down shark attack scenes from movies. Right. So my answer is shark questions. There are not very, not too many videos on uh, animal, uh, not uh, expert rate, 10 shark attacks in movies and TV. Uh, shark encounters that will terrorize you. Uh, shark scientists react to shark attack videos. This is all mostly about shark attacks. So if that's the case, you could go to Google too and, they, and then ask for, hey, um, articles on shark attack. And I just randomly picked a topic in the real time, right? So, um, so I don't see um, articles on shark attacks. Uh, this playing one of twenty surfers share their waves shark attacks, but fear not. Um, so I don't really like those uh, topics. Okay, so this is like um, this is they are just showing like uh, thing. I'm looking for an actual shark attack. Um, okay, let's uh, scientific. Let's call it scientific article. This is what you're going to feel, you know, after some time uh, when you go on Google. So, 
Okay, this is good. Yearly worldwide. Okay, so it's the Florida Museum of Natural History. So do you see that at a glance? So it's actually showing you a really a real good summary about shark attacks, shark bites, and other stuff. So you kind of, in this particular case, um, I'm not. I'm going to be messy here. Okay, so I'm going to be messy here. I'm just copy the whole thing. Um, it might not look cool, but it doesn't matter. So I'm going to go here, copy this, and I'm going to paste it in OpenAI. Okay, so so I'll be like, okay. Read a summary. Looks like my caps lock is on. Create a summary of my uh, summary of the article below. Just to specify that it's an article in less than 500 words. Okay, so it got it. So it's gonna create a summary. So you got a summary of this article. As it's creating, I'm gonna look for another article because I don't want to wait around, right? I just want to move on and do other stuff too, right? We, we, need, to be, uh, we need to be looking at this and we need to move on. International shark attacks file program is here. Don't call them shark attacks, scientists say. So this is another article on that. Uh, what do we want to call them? Banana attacks on the beaches of Western Australia, California crushing wave. And this is like, we, we don't want to solve our panel details uh, in our article. So, so this is a summary of it. So I just copied the summary. Okay. Uh, actually, uh, I would create, I will save this as uh, shark attack, shark attack one uh, and shark attack two. It's the same thing, shark attack one. Uh, and then you save it there. And then what we are gonna do is we are gonna copy paste this thing, this article here. And then we are gonna ask OpenAI to do the same thing. Summarize the whole thing. So this is another article. Uh, and I'm not copying the advertisement. And eventually there will be better ways to do this, all these things. But this is just the beginning, right? So I'm gonna copy this. And this is just an example. Uh, by the way, this article might not turn out to be amazing. The reason is that uh, these are this is a unique, weird topic that I that I picked real time to demonstrate to you the powers of powers of uh, this AI engines. And by the way, this is not just about OpenAI either. It's about like having like different systems that you could use. And there are so many other uh, other AI systems coming out for free in the world. Uh, so we don't need to have advertisement uh, coming in the world. You can just use any of that to um, any of that to build these things. It doesn't have to be OpenAI. Right now, I'm using OpenAI because that's the only system that we have that we could use to build this. So same thing, article content, less than 500 words, and then submit. And it's going to create a 500 word summary for you. And that's not what I'm trying to communicate. I'll tell you why I'm doing this right now. So it's creating this thing. So it's creating a summary here. Okay. And so I'm going to close this mod of this. And meanwhile, I'm going to look for another topic. Um, biggest stock market crashes in the history. Okay. So we'll go into that. So here's what you do. In order to save our time, what we will do is, do you see this, this one? So this is a summary of the above article. And now you have summary one, okay, summary one, and some content. You, you understand what I mean? Summary one. And summary two, 
from another content, some other content. And you could say summary three, yet not, you don't write it like this. I'm just showing an example, another content. Uh, so you have summary one, summary two, summary three, diff three different contents, right? And then, and you could create a summary from these three summaries, and this is your unique thing. And it will actually give you a unique thing that is about you. You can do the same thing with YouTube videos. And I'll talk to you in another video on how to get the three YouTube videos and create a summary and create your own things, right? So we five crashes in US history and then take three videos like that and you could summarize it. And um, you, you could summarize that. And from those, these three summaries, you could actually come up with, uh, come up with a unique content of your own. That's how you create unique, valuable content uh, about anything. So you, what, no matter what you want to create a content on, uh, you could actually create that. And everything that I'm teaching you on the series, it can be applied on each other, which means tomorrow I'm going to talk about how to write a chapter of your book in 15 minutes. Let's say if you spend 15 minutes, how can you actually write a chapter for a book that you want to be writing about? And let's say uh, we are, let's be, let's talk about you are writing a book about stock market crashes. And one of the, one of for the first chapter is biggest stock market crash. And you want to talk about that. How do you do that? That's what I'm going to talk about tomorrow. And this way, if you want to be an expert in your field, you want to be expert in your field, and you want to be known as, as a specialist in your field, you could use this as a tool to create uh, like amazing content and be the authority in your field without having a lot of knowledge, with reasonable knowledge and being able to intelligently ask some intelligent questions, you should be able to come up with amazing content that will blow people away, okay? I'll show you tomorrow how to write a chapter, an amazing chapter for your book in three different levels um, using ChatGPT, all right? Or any other AIs for, for that matter. I'll see you tomorrow. Talk to you later. Bye.